You have to understand the three basic law of money. Save, invest, and reinvest. And let the miracle of compounding, so the money can be compounded, di ba? Welcome to Peaceabilities here in CBRC.TV. I'm your host, Arman Benko of the Polyco Foundation and KSK SMP Co. Magandang araw po sa inyo lahat. Saan man kayo nanonood? This is the new medium, the new TV, the new way of broadcasting CBRC.TV. The virtual space of the future today. Today, I have one of the most revered persons in my life as our guest tonight. Hindi nga alam yun. Ha? And now niya lang malalaman and I say it on air pa. Because, because totoo. Ha? My siblings are very much into the stock market. Ako, hindi po eh. Uh, my brother, uh, two of my brothers, and my sister. And then I have Francisco Colaico as one of my uh, mentors. Both. Mr. Kolaiko, my siblings, mga kapatid ko, they all refer to our guest as one who can truly, genuinely, with honesty and integrity, of course, experience and expertise to talk about the subject matter tonight. Stock market and investing in general, uh, up to the basic principles of money. Let us welcome founder and chairman of Call Financials, Edward K. Lee, Sir Edward. Yes, yes. Thank you, thank you, Arman. Thank you for inviting me. Yes, Sir Edward Lee. Thank you very much. Uh, you know, this has been the most uh, sought after uh, topic. Uh, as people asking, uh, we have a very interactive uh, program, and people asking uh, always. Nung uh, dami namin dini discuss about investments, A stock market, stock market. Eh, Ngayon namin talaga naka-schedule sa calendar tapos ang ganda pa ang daming nangyayari sa paligid natin na uh, mas maganda manggaling sa inyo. Uh, thank you, thank you for uh, uh, accepting our invitation. Kita nyo, Sir Edward, ah, magyayabang ako konti. Uh, nasa almost 100 na kagad yung uh, viewers natin. Live yun ah, live yun ah, Sir Edward ah. Uh, ganun sila kauhaw kasi Sir Edward sa uh, uh, lalo na tama timely na information tungkol sa stock market and uh, sikat na sikat syempre yung call financials. Uh, at konting introduction naman uh, about you and call financials before ko uh, banggitin yung mga ano. Yung ano, yung uh, when, when we started, uh, we, I became, a, I bought a 15% of a company no? way back in 1983. 15%. Pagbili ko ng kumpanya, when I bought it, 15%, I just bought it. Ang nangyari is that uh, Ninoy, uh, there was a, Ninoy was uh, assassinated in 19... Yes, yes. Oh, so, 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 in 1983. So, they wanted to close the company already. So, but teka, teka, kakabili ko lang eh, di ba? So, <laughs> ganun lang talaga yung That's how, that, that's what it is. <coughs> then, and then, of course, a lot of challenges from 1983 to 1986, tapos nag-revolusyon, di ba? After the revolution, the, the, the majority people sold, decided to sell the company na. So, ang ginawa ko, I bought it. I bought the company with my group and I changed the name to City Securities. So from Vietnam, uh -huh. it City Securities. Yan. So we became, we became, we were the new kid on the block at that time. But uh -huh. I've been, uh, I've been uh, involved in the stock market since I was 17, 18 years old. So I'm still there. Yes, yes, yes. I'm still there in 1973, 74. And I'm still there. Because of course, I'm still there. Because of course, I'm so, ubus din para yun, no? so this I was explaining to you. We had to go to that experience. That's why I was in the, I was with the president of the Philippine Stock Exchange last week, and I visited him, uh, and I, I told him it is not, it is not protection. It is education. That's that's the role of COL. Call financial is all about advocacy, all about educating. That's why the new tagline natin. We believe that all Filipinos deserve to be rich. Because eh. alam na natin to. Eh. Ada intindihan naman natin po ito. Eh, 
So, so we we had to we really spend a lot of time really educating. But of course, Arman, alam mo naman yung negosyo natin, di ba? Education. Payaka na tayo. We went to all the different region, all the OFWs. You know, you know, the biggest challenge natin. Anything we give for free, people do not appreciate it. Nako mo. Hindi niya. Agree. Oh, so. So, so let's say, for example, punta kami na Hong Kong. Walang tao, liyanlaan ko kami talaga. So, those are the challenges that we have. No? Libre na, nandun na tayo. We went to Taiwan. Kawa, mah mahirap talaga yung mga kababayan natin dun sa labas. Talaga, nakakaawa talaga ako sila. So, that was yeah. always our challenge. But of course, we continue to do this because it was an advocacy. So, 1999, we decided to create a, a, a subsidiary, uh, well, a new company. It's called CitySec Online. And then eventually we change it into call financial now. So so yeah. it's, it's all about and I because when we were listed, we have to talk to the Philippine Stock Exchange. But kasi kilala nila ako, kasi I was the chairman of the Manila Stock Exchange Computerization again. And then the PSE. So we put it together. I was with the board for two years. So nung ko yung City Secona, yung call financial as a listed company in 2006. We had only 272 customers. Na kumpisa kami 272. Pero kasi ho kilala tayo, alam nila, hindi naman tayo manluloko. We're trying to help people, educate them. So they allowed us to lease. You know, if the yeah. PSC did not allow us to lease, ha, at that time, parang startup lang ho tayo, di ba? Puro kwento yes. lang eh. And yes. we used that platform to start educating people. So it took us a long time talaga. Mga 10, 10 years ho talaga yan, pinaghirapan ho natin. Mas swerte lang. Tama ba? Sampung taon na, sampung taon yung pinaghirapan natin yan. Eh. So the startup was really difficult. Mas swerte lang tayo kasi we know how to make money naman talaga in the global market. Marunong tayo sa capital market. I mean, that's our, I mean, tagal na natin ho dyan eh, di ba? So it's just a matter of educating and hopefully, hopefully, nandyan na yan eh, libre lahat yan eh. Nasa YouTube, you know, I did at Tarlac State University. If this, it's just one hour, di ba? So the problem yeah. with people, they're in a hurry to make money. It takes time. Is there any secret? No, it's time in the market. Not time in the market, it's time in the market. Paya kan talaga ho. Mahira talaga kumita ng pera ho. Uh, Sir Edward, ang ganda na nung sinabi mo kagad. Uh, alam mo nung when I was uh, pinagalitan ako ng kapatid ko, seryosohin mo kang panoorin yung video. You know, I, I, put a, I got my uh, pen and paper and pinanood na kita. Uh, aba, nung nagkukentuhan na kami ni Mr. Kulay ko, sabi nga, ang dahil mo nang alam ah. Sabi ko, yun, yun, yun sa CitySec Online. Sabi ko, non, CitySec Online pa. Yeah. Uh, mga videos, pareho pang mahaba, buhok, makapal-kapal ang ano natin na, doon. Wala na, wala na. na, na, na Kumalbo na ho tayo. <laughs> uh, may sinabi ka na kagad ah. Uh, naalala ko tuloy yung uh, isang line mo noon about, about time, timing, and all. Sir Edward, Boss Edward. Uh, yes, Eh, kailangan natin maghanap buhay, kaya medyo... Kailangan ho, kailangan ho. Pwede eh. So, Yung advocacy natin, uh, buyan. <laughs> yes, yes. And sila ang tumutulong mag, uh, uh, to keep our program uh, alive. And uh, uh, yun nga, eh, Sir Edward, ito, uh, kanina nabanggit mo na. Libre na nga yung binibigay na seminar. Hindi pa ina-attendan, no, uh, Sir Edward? Eh, ako, ang guilty of it also. Nandun na nga sa YouTube eh. Gusto ko pa yung mabilisan, sabihin sa akin yung, you know, sabihin sa akin kagad, oh, anong stock? I'm sure, Sir Edward, lagi kang tinatanong ano. Sir Edward, lagi what mo, is the lagi stock lagi to pick? Mo. What's your stock pick? Lagi, no, ha? Lagi. lagi, no, lagi. Um, yeah, Sir Edward, yeah, very... Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yes. No, no, everybody, everybody wants to make money. It's just that they don't like to put time. Di ba? Correct, Ayun correct. Yung and, yan. Gusto niya sabihin mo na lang kung anong bilid mo, di ba? Mabilis, di ba? That's why yung mga yes, hinahype yes. ng mga, mga, yung mga, yung mga, mga penny stocks na hinahype, that, that's why they want to go there. Kasi binibentahan sila, eh, di ba? May kwento. Yes, yes. Yan ang gusto nila kasi umakagbaba ang presyo, di ba? So they get yes, excited. Yes. Parang, parang entertainment yung, 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 yung ginagawa nila. Uh, Sir Edward, um, uh, konti lang, ha? I'll try to put some structure. Una, sa inyo po, why did you get into the stock market? Kayo, kayo muna. Ah, hindi, kasi ano, hindi, hindi ho ka tayo marunong mag-aral eh. So, ang nangyayari, uh, naghahanap tayo ng extra oh. activities. So, there is an organization na tinatawag natin na Junior Achievement of the Philippines. Junior ah, yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah, so, yeah, 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 yeah,
Yes, yes. So JA, JA. So I was one of the company pre, mini company president 1972 yeah, that was 17 years old. Tapos ang ginawa namin, nagpe-print kami ng t-shirt sa top company, di ba? Tinuturuan kami para maging entrepreneur. So JA is really a platform to help young kids to become entrepreneurs. So nandoon kami, doon doon ako. I was one of the company president. In fact, yung company pre, yung company ko is called Neso. Kasi the day that we put it together, it was new society. It was the beginning of the martial law yan eh. I remember <laughs> yes. 1972, yeah, no? Yes, yes, yes. So, so, so then we visited a, one of my mentors. We visited one of the mentors that came from Jardine. He was, he was with Jardine. He, in fact, he, still, he writes for Manila Standard, I think, wife, uh, Leo Alejandrino. So, siya yung, ano, siya yung parang nag-expose sa akin sa stock market. We visited his office. We were young. Marami kami. Pa kami. At the back of his, ano, at the back of his uh, office, ang daming mga chart. Tinanong ko na, what's that? Sabi na, this is, uh, this is our charts of listed companies. Eh, syempre, alam mo naman, Arman, during our time, 1970s, puro mga, puro mga mining issues, oil issues, uh, di ba yung uh, mga penny stocks natin, eh, di ba? O syempre, hindi tayo marunong, nagbabasa, binigay ako ng libro, nagbabasa ako, tapos, if you do not act, di eh, syempre, hindi ka matututo. Siya, nagbukas ako ng account, ayun, 1973, bull market, ang laki ng kinikita ko. 1974, guhit lang, ako, gusto ako. So I got to go to school. I have to, ano, kailangan. Nag, nagtrabaho ko 3 to 10. 8 pesos a day sa, sa isang computer center. Till today, it's still there. It's uh, Equitable Computer Services. Equicom. It's a, it's a, it's a, Equitable, Equitable, I was with Equitable Bank talaga. So my, uh, my one and only boss is a uh, Equitable Bank. Equitable Computer Services. Equicom talaga. So I started yeah. there. That's the reason why sa COL, lahat ng mga tumulong sa akin nung ginagawa namin itong mga computerization came from the old Equicom, uh, Equicom uh, mga software engineer, mga computer engineer. It's, it, that's, so this is not, hindi naman nandyan lang eh. Ang nangyari, it was because of the relationship we have, eh, di ba? When I was working with them. And then they helped me build the platform, they helped me build the website. Yeah, sin sila yan, silang tumulong sa akin. So, then of course, kasi mahilig ako magsugal kasi dati, di ba? So, nangyari, so it became a combination between computerization and trading the market. Yun, yun ang nangyari. Kaya, kaya City, City Securities was born because of that. Right. Because no. I also, I became the, I became a Manila Stock Exchange Head of Computer in 1986. I held the exchange computerized. Oh. 1994, Philippine Stock Exchange, I was the chairman of the computer committee. Kaya, Puro ta, puro, I mean, I was involved in operations, in uh, putting it all together for the for the merger of the Philippine Stock Exchange. So, I was part of it. So, so ano, ano, it's a his long history talaga. Matagal na talaga ako tayo dito sa, sa, sa negosyo natin. Um, did you have a, did you study computers? Uh, wala, wala. Hindi tayo marunong. Hindi tayo marunong yan. Pero ikaw na test ng ano ha? Oh, mm. We were just exposed. We are, I'm, I'm from operations. Eh. Diba? Sa operations ako. Eh. I run the... Kasi, diba? Banko. Diba? Nagko-computerize kami dati. Bagong-bago lang yan. Eh. 1974. Eh. Wala. Araw-araw, minumura kami ng mga branch manager. Kasi your, your manual and computerization, diba? Inaayos natin yan. Eh. So, it was a three to four years of uh, experience running at operations talaga. In operations, okay. ako. Then, but then, of course, may mga kilala tayo na mga engineers na mga programmer, mga system designers. Eh. So, naka, nakalusot naman po na tinulungan tayo when we were starting uh, the, the COL, the CitySec Online, uh, on, uh, what we call this, uh, uh, platform, an online platform. So, sila yung tumulong din po sa atin. Alright. Uh, Sir Edward, ano ba yung stock market? Uh, for the benefit of our audience, uh, nag-polling ako kanina eh, sa mga profile ng usual na nanonood sa atin. Uh, sadly, pero siguro, you, eh, ikaw, very, uh, lagi kang uh, the optimistic uh, person that I know of you, ha? Uh, kakaunti, more than half, boss, hindi nila alam yung stock market. Ano oh. ba yung stock market? Uh, ang stock market, simple lang eh. Let's say, for example, uh, let's say, let's say, your favorite bank is, let's say, you, you, you have an account with BDO, di ba? BDO. Okay. Right? So so video can you imagine ah, if you are if you if you buy if you put your money in the bank ah, diba? normally we put our money in the bank. Wala pa. 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 Wala pa
Oh, mm. so it takes seven to two years bagging to double your money, di ba? Right? <laughs> yeah, diba? yeah. So yeah, you have rule of seventy-two. So tinuturo natin, tinuturo natin, you have ten twenty percent of your spare cash. Yung mga ano lang, yung di ba? Pinakita ko sa isang slide yung latte factor. Wag ka na yes, yes. ng sandbag, uminom ka na lang ng mini sa mini stuff, di ba? Twenty pesos. Tapi mo yung one hundred pesos mo, then you start investing instead of putting your money in the bank you just invest in video diba mm-hmm. invest mo na yung pera mo sa video so assuming 10% compounded rate to return yan in 10 years millionaire ka na rin eh the problem is people don't see it that way diba so you are part owner parang 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 may marami akong kwento diyan sa mga ganun eh uh, there was a we were encouraging people to invest uh, in uh, SM SM diba shoe SM eh. and alam mo yeah. ang diba you, everybody goes to SM diba mega mall diba Mall of Asia. But can you imagine, ah, if you put your money in BDO or put your money in the in SM, in the C family, can you imagine they are, the owners are the one working for you? Eh, diba? You're part owner. <laughs> diba? So so this this was, I was giving a talk. I was giving a talk. So sabi lang, so we have a recommendation to, to sell SM at that time. Kasi ang laki ng inakyat. Eh, diba? Then may, may, may tumawag sa akin, isang artist, very famous artist, Sir, kailangan ko pa ba ibenta itong SM na ito? Sabi ko, depende kung may cash flow ka. Di ba? Kung may cash flow, tuloy-tuloy lang, peso cost average lang. Tapos sabi niya, sabi ko, so bakit ayaw mo ibenta? Kasi ho, sir, pag pumupunta ko ng mall, para ako may ahari. Uh, very good analogy. Di ba? So in other words, you go to the bank, you are now a part owner. Di ba? You are now a part owner. Also, you go to SM. Ikaw rang may ari, eh. part owner ka rin. Or sa Jollibee, part owner ka na rin. Di ba? But you have to select these companies, the good companies. Eh. Meron kaming, meron kaming ano niyan eh, meron kaming checklist niyan eh. It's called the four P's eh. People, product, potential, predictable. Di ba? You, you want to understand who the company that you're buying eh. Di ba? Ang problema sa most people, gusto nila yung pabilisan. Wala, walang pabilisan itong sa stock market na ito. Pwede kang mabilis kumita, pero mabilis din maubos. Di ba? What is what we're looking for is consistency. Nagtatabi ka lang ng pera. Meaning, pay yourself. Di ba? We always talk about the three basic law of money. Ano itong three basic law of money natin? Save. Nagtatabi ka. Let's say, maski na. Tapos, let's assume yung sinasabi ko sa mga. Let's say, 20, 30,000 pesos lang ang matang sweldo mo. Magtabi ka lang ng 2, 3,000. Pay yourself. Di ba? For yes. your future. So, nagtatabi ka. 2,000, 3,000 pesos. Lalagay mo, invest, so save, meron nandun. Savings, meron. Problema, pag nilagay mo sa banko, so kita ka lang less than 1%. It takes 72 years to double your money. So you need have to know where to put it, where to invest in it, di ba? So pag nilagay mo, so save, invest, the third one is what? Pag kumikita na lumalago, may dividendo, you have to reinvest it. Hindi mo wag mong gastusin. Kasi pag ginastos mo yan, mawawala yan. Yung what we call the miracle of, of compounding, nawawala, eh, di ba? So what yeah. is most important, is let time, let time, di ba? Ang biggest problem nito, the Arban, is even my driver. We, we started, the driver, security guard namin, pinapapin, ginagawa namin itong investment pro, pati kasambahay natin dito. Tinutulungan din natin yan. Ang problema sa kanila, pag nakikita na nila yung pera, gagasus na nila yan. Diba? Yan ako mo. Yan, that is the biggest challenge. That is the biggest challenge. They cannot understand that they really, it's time in the market is 5 years, 10 years, 20 years. Pag-gising nila, yung mga tinatabi na 100, 200 pesos a day, malaking pera na nga yan eh. Di ba? So it's really what we call the three, you have to understand the three basic law of money. Save, invest, and reinvest. And let the miracle of compounding. So the money can be compounded. Di ba? No, 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 no. So that, that's just the most, it's really so simple ah. The problem is, di ba, people get get scared when the market when the market goes down. Uy, nako na wow. After ten years of investing, uy, may pera ka na, natatakot ka na kasi pag may, di ba? There's so there's so many what we call the uh, crisis, eh, di ba? Crisis. Yes. So, what we call may uh, political crisis, di ba? Meron the uh, policy interest rates crisis, di ba? Credit crisis. Tapos kaya may bago pa tayo pandemic. Diba? Market can go down 30, 40, 50 percent eh. Pag hindi mo naintindihan na, matatakot ka. Kasi parang nawala. Diba? Yung 10 years yes. sa investing mo, nawala ng kalahat eh. Siyempre, hindi mo naman masisisi man natakot eh. That's why, the easiest ah, the easiest ah, 
is the most simple. Pag wala ka pang pera, very simple. Tagta magtabi ka lang, buy the best companies, buy the blue chips, Ayala, the Ayala family, the SM. Let these titans work for you. That's how simple it is. The problem is, after 10 years, di ba, malaki na yung pera mo, di ba? Kailangan matuto ka na. You have to watch all our videos na. It's what we call active investing. Kailangan maintindihan mo na. Risk on, risk off. It's even more challenging for the people who have money. Pero pag nag-umpisa ka lang, tabi ka lang ng pera. Tapos invest by the best companies, the blue chips, and then get the dividend, reinvest it. Over time, 5, 10, 20 years from today, malaking pera na yan. Maging malaking pera na yan. Sir Edward, uh, meaning ko sa'yo, uh, you know naman that I do seminars, di ba? Financial literacy. Yes, yes, yes. Pero, ito naman, turo sa akin ng kaibigan natin, Dean Pax Lapit. Okay lang, yes, okay lang na i-quote mo. Okay lang, uh, okay lang na gamitin mo. Pero i-quote mo. acknowledge mo. And I do. And I do. Uh, ayan, reminder sa kanya ni Dean Pax Lapit. I always quote you on the timing, not time. Can you explain a little further, uh, lalo na baka maidikit mo na dun sa cost averaging na lagi mong bidang dun ko lang naintindihan ha yung cost averaging si yung tao mo si Baredo Baredo si Juanes Juanes oh yung, yung mistiso ano, yung mistiso yes 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 yes, 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 yes. sa akin 25 years na rin po sa akin yan wow uh, yes yes, yes. Oh, yes siya yung nagano eh siya yung, siya yung pinapanood ko dun sa cost yes. averaging related yes. to EIP pero yes. Sir Edward, let's simplify. Bakit mo sinabi? And I I I, I always uh, quote you and acknowledge you. Ah, uh, thank you. Be assured. Thank you. Uh, ano, bakit timing, not uh, time, not timing? Kasi ganito yan, no? Pag nag-uumpisa ka lang, it's really time. Kailangan may time ka. Kasi, let's say, naglalagay ka lang, naghuhulo ka lang ng 1,000, 2,000, or 5,000 a month. Di ba? Assuming, 10%, yeah. let's say, or 2,000, 3,000. It has to be timing. The problem is, you don't, when the market, go, market goes up and down, market doesn't go in a straight line. And can you imagine, Armanda, in that, we peaked in 2013-12. The, the high market was 7,400 in the index. Today, it's below, below, below 7,000. That means kung nag-invest ka, pag nag-invest ka na for the last 13 years, hindi ka kumikita. Hindi ka pa kumikita 8, 9 years, luging-lugi ka pa. Diba? Uh -huh. So that, that's why it has to be time in the market. Now, market was up and down. So, wag ka na mag-isip. Wag ka na mag-isip. Basta, hulug, hinuhulog mo lang every month yan. Hinuhulogan lang yan. Para the yeah. volatility of the market, if the market goes down, you buy more shares. If the market goes up, you buy less shares. The same amount, buy less shares. So over time, yeah. Your cost is at the bottom. Diba? Pag yeah, umakita yeah. yung market, kikita ka na. Diba? Now, the problem yeah. is, it's really a lot of work lang. It's really, what we call this, uh, uh, kailangan, kailangan may hand-holding. Eh. Kaya kailangan palagi na, diba, hinahandhold mo. So, huwag kang matakot. Because crisis, when there's a crisis, it creates opportunity. Diba? It creates yeah. opportunity eh. Ang problema, pag may sale sa mega, world, mega mall, nandun tayo lahat. <laughs> Pag nagsasale yung ano, pag nagsasale yung stock market, ay nako, nakakot ka lang. Ganun lang yun eh. Ganun lang talaga yan eh, di ba? So yeah, this, yeah. Is, this is very challenging. And I really, because we are human beings, di ba? So we will have yeah. emotions, di ba? Pag umakit, yeah. uy, maglalagay ka ng maraming pera. O mag, eh, mas, parang sila ba, may Alexis, may, may alternate coins, may Bitcoin, lahat na ng sugal, nandun ka yeah. kasi umakit eh, di ba? Pag tinetetan, yeah. Wala na, kawawa ka. So, pag may sale sa Mega Mall, lahat tayo nandun. Di ba? Pero pag stock market, pag bumaba, natatakot ka. Yeah. Arman, mawawala ba yung SM? Mawawala ba yung mga Ayala? Mawawala ba yeah. yung Globe? Hindi sila mawawala. Tayo mawawala. Sila, hindi. They will be here for the next 50, 100 years. That's the most important. Di ba? That's why kailangan. You have to believe. Ha? Kailangan. You have to believe that the believe in the Philippine growth story. Philippine growth story. So we are what? Demographics. 26, 27 years old. I was just talking to somebody the other day. I was sharing. The resiliency of the Filipino people. Saan tayo hahanap na yung culture na ang babayit ang mga Filipino? Pwede magpaape. Tapos pupunta. You know, we have OFWs and BPOs. Ha? 
60, 70 billion dollar a year still continue to come into the Philippines. Diba? Saan ka hanap ng isang country na you have this 50, 60, 70 billion na pumapasok? Kaya, yeah. so, kaya ako, I always believe, I always believe that we have to understand that eh. that we Filipinos, we Filipinos, ah, really, once you understand it very well, ah, we should be doing very well. Dapat maayos ito. Ang problema lang, syempre, politiko, maingay naman lahat yan eh. Diba? Maingay lang. Pero, lahat. pero Sir Edward, yes. You, yes. you are saying that for a fact, hindi yan dahil mahal mo lang ang bayan, maganda ang Pilipinas, you believe the Philippine growth story. You don't, you're not saying that just because of love of country, because of hard facts, right? Yes. The yes. demographics, the OFW yes. remittances. Yes. Sir Edward, yes. my next question, my next mm. question. Yes. Uh, sa stock market, laging sinasabi, buy low, sell high. Yung reminder, uh, lesson nakuha ko, first lesson yes. nakuha ko, Sir Edward, more than a decade ago, matagal na yun eh, yung uh, yes. videos yes. nyo eh. Uh, it's time, not timing. And then, yes. ang paborito ko, timing the market. Yes. Timing the market. Okay. Kaya nga, we separate it na eh. Diba? Nag-separate na tayo eh. Passive yeah. investing, cost averaging lang yan. Huwag ka na mag-isip. Nagtatabi ka lang ng pera. The problem is, like sinabi ko kanina, pag malaki na yung pera mo, kailangan na intindihan mo na. May konting sophistication na tayo. Di ba? Kailangan na intindihan what we call a corporate life cycle. Corporate life cycle. Ano ba itong corporate life cycle na yung tinuturo natin? Yung first, startup. Di ba? Wala pang laman. Kwento lang. Second, yes. young growth. Nag-umpisa. Hirap na hirap. May benta, pero hindi kumikita. Then, naayos yes. na. Naging high growth na. Di ba? Earnings is good, earnings is good, revenues is good, earnings is good. Then, it matures. Di ba? So, may corporate life cycle yun eh. So, from startup, young growth, high growth, mature growth, mature, mature, and declining. So, kailan? May konting sophistication ka na ano bang binibili mo. Di ba? Kaya may buy low, sell high yan. Kasi you need to understand, pag mahal, you have to sell it. Pag mura, you have to buy it. Ganun lang, kaya lang yung buy, low, sell, high yan. Di ba? On the matured companies, ha, kailangan maintindihan mo yan. That's why it's called active investing. May konting active investing na. Di ba? Pag devaluations, fair value, mataas na masyado. Di ba? Kasi, alam mo naman tayo, alam mo naman tayo, kasi we are human being eh. So, the human beings are, have four major qualities eh. What is the four major? It's called greed. O, di ba? Greed. Kailangan greed. Hope. Greed, hope, fear, desperation. So, you know, the stock market is all about emotion. Eh, diba? the, what we call the, the understanding of the emotional cycle of investing. Kailan naiintindihan mo yan? Pag kumakit ng market, wala. Nandyan lahat ng pera. Tapos pag bumaba, ay hindi. Baka hopefully na, baka okay lang. Tapos pag bumaba, natatakot ka na. Tapos hindi mo pa binibenta. Pag, pag buhit, desperation. Kasi may pandemic, kaya the country is in a mess. But you know, these are these are opportunity 